What's up everybody? Welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be showing you the deck that got me from Arena 12 to Arena 13. But before we get into the video, I'd really appreciate if you could hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications. It notifies you when I post a new video. Alright guys, so without further ado, let's get into the deck. The deck we'll be using is consists of with the Golem, Mini P.E.K.K.A., Wizard, Log, Bats, Witch, Skeleton Army, and the Hog Rider. Now, we're gonna jump into some games to show you that this deck is really good. Alright. First, I think we're gonna put down the Golem. Actually, yeah, we're gonna wait. He put down a Goblin Drill, so we're gonna put down Bats and a Mini P.E.K.K.A. Then shortly after, I'm gonna put down the the Hog Rider on the right side to hopefully deal some damage. Our mini Pika's not doing so good on the left. I'm gonna put down a Wizard to kill the Witch, which hopefully will happen. Log to take out the Ske Skarmy. Should have put that log a bit more closer to the bridge so I hit the tower, but it's all right. We're still doing good. Now, we're going to go in with the Golem. Never mind, we're going to go in with the Skeleton Army because he put a Goblin Jill again, which is not going to do some good for him because we can counter that. Now we're going to put down a Golem, finally. This Golem should, do, should deal a ton of damage to his tower. Now, behind it, we're going to be put a witch to deal a lot of damage with the golem tanking then we're gonna put the hog rider on the right side to take out that skeleton that building in the middle and then we're not gonna deal any we're gonna do one hit of damage that's pretty good skeleton army this this elixir golem is gonna give us a lot of elixir, so we can, so we can put down the wizard after our witch dies. So then we could take out that witch on the other team, our enemy. We're gonna take out that. Okay, he put elixir golem. Now we're gonna go in with a witch. That should do really good damage to get some more elixir from the elixir golem. To then hopefully putting down the golem to wreck his tower we're in the lead i think it's a dub already but now we're gonna put down the golem it should be a for sure dub because when you're at this part of the game they cannot do anything now we're just going through he's already he's already just putting everything down but our hog rider did a did a hit pretty good we're gonna get even more elixir from this elixir golem because he has nothing to kill my scar me with he should have thought about that i guess he's in it and there you go we won the game that easy guys it's it's a really good deck you, you never lose now we're gonna go on to the other game all right loading in Now we're gonna go in with our hog rider. Never mind, we're gonna go in with skeleton army, but that did not go good. Mini Pekka. He made us use a lot of elixir, and I just didn't play that well. Now we're gonna go in the hog rider to deal a few hits on the tower. All right, now we're gonna put in a wizard to kill the electro wizard whatever he's called all right we're doing pretty good all right he is all right it's an infernal dragon and those bomb skeletons which i do not know the name of they did not get a hit on our tower which is really good because that would have been really bad our tower would have been probably at 2000 health or even less 
All right, mini P.E.K.K.A. to kill the Electro Wizard. He also had a P.E.K.K.A., but no worries. Now we're gonna put a log so then those don't deal any damage to our tower, because again, it would be really bad. Then I think we're just gonna go in with the Hog Rider. If he doesn't put anything. Or we might just go with the Golem. Yeah, we're gonna go for a Golem right at the bridge, basically. So then his Mega Knight does not jump on our tower and wreck our tower. Now we're gonna put in... Now... Now we're gonna put in a Skeleton Army. Which, that was not really good, because he had a log. But it's alright. We're gonna put a witch so this inferno dragon doesn't deal a ton of damage on our tower. Bats, so it can kill the Mega Knight. He got one jump on our tower, but that's still alright. So we're gonna go into the Hog Rider, then a wizard. So then those bomb skeletons don't hit our tower again. Our Hog Rider's gonna tank. We got our mini P.E.K.K.A. to kill the Mega Knight which did not really work well, so we're gonna put down a witch. And now we're just gonna put a Skarmie in to wreck both of his Mega Knight and Mini P.E.K.K.A. The Mega Knight sadly did deal some damage on our tower, but that's not gonna harm us. All right, Hog Rider got no hits. Still all right. A log to kill his skeleton bomb guys. Forgot what they're called. If you can put that in the comments, then I might remember next time. Then we're going to go in with the Golem, because it's over time. And we get more Elixir faster. Then we're going to go in with the Witch behind it again, just like we did last game. He's got a Mega Knight, which is not going to do too much. We're going to put a Mini P.E.K.K.A. to deal tons of damage to that Mega Knight. And then he has a mini P.E.K.K.A., which does not matter, so we're just gonna now basically bridge spam. And that's basically a dub. This tower's going down quickly. There you go, guys. This deck is super good. One star, but we're in, my, we're in Serenity Peak, but I used this in Arena 12, and it was really good. It was super good. Spooky Town. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the deck again if you want to screenshot it. But yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.